sure well, you have to have something to use yeah. for it. It lets you go live. <laughs> we are tearing down the fence for the pigs. Walk forward with them. I'm gonna try to keep them in focus. Tell them what they're doing. Tearing the fence down. Tearing the fence down. Say so we are tearing the fence down. For the pigs. Yep. Ah! Wasp. No fire ants. Oh. No. Yes. Hey guys, we're gonna go out here and check on the animals and do some stuff. I gotta get this fence up for the pigs over here. I gotta separate them pigs. That boy, he's just aggravating her, just bumping on her. trying to mount her it's enough bless his heart got all my rabbits over here got their fans on them they chilling right now and uh we're gonna go out here Go out here where Steve is. Make sure he's okay. Yep. Hey, Steve. You're okay. Yeah, I took down that middle fence out here at the pigs. Let me wipe this camera off. It's just so foggy. <laughs> it's popped up because it is so hot out here. Okay, that's better. We built, me and my son, Rusty, built Clyde. A little building over here because this is where I'm going to split the pasture. Bonnie is on one side and Clyde will be on the other. 
this would be his little place out of the shade. I mean, out of the sun. Nice little shade right here. And when it rains. Yeah, it's like 20 degrees cooler under here. And I left the back open, but the fence is here, so he can get a breeze from that, too. Come on, babies! Looks so much better with the bush hog. But it's 92 degrees. The index is 100. It's crazy. It's just too much. But I have got to split them up because he is really just aggravating her to death. What you gonna talk about? You need to leave her alone. I'm gonna put your butt over here. Don't get tangled up in the wire. And leave her alone. Let's get out of this hot sun. Yeah. I already fed y'all this morning. I filled your wallow up, filled your water up. Y'all should be some happy pigs. Happy, happy, happy. Happy, 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 yeah. Clyde's just being his male self. Yeah. Mark done an awesome job. And my kids and grandkids done an awesome job helping. We tore that old pallet fence down and I went and got some of these posts to put up. I'm gonna put that electric fence up and put him over here. This will be his side. I gotta fix that fence a lot better than that though. That's just temporary. A temporary fix. I have a actual pig electric fence coming. This is going to be so much better. So much better, y'all. Yeah. Get under the shade. It's the best thing for them because it is so hot. <sighs> so hot. This water is in the sunshine. It's just hot. Some cool water there, buddy. Winds are whooping. I gotta get that limb off of there. It's rubbing on that metal. It'll mess around and bend it. And where the nails are in it, it'll just stretch it more and more. Everybody's got their little fans blowing on them. Let me see. 
and turn hers on. Now then, I don't know where my chickens are. Oh, there they are. Oh, they down here, they feel that fan. That's exactly what it is. Yeah, see the big squirrel fan? I have it blowing down here on the rabbits. And the other rabbits, they have their own little personal fan blowing on them. So everybody's got a chance to be cool. Come on, Cotton. Cottontail. It's cloudy. Yeah, I got in here and I blowed all these feathers out the best I could. It looks like they're trying to blow back up this way. All of them feathers down there. I caught the possum in the trap this morning. Took care of that dude. There's a hole right there, and I'm trying to figure out what the world's in it. So I'm going to catch whatever that is. Mark got me these traps, and I'm going to use them. This is where my chickens go to roost. Hey girl, I'm just in here checking things out. Seeing what all y'all got going on. There's two eggs. There's two eggs. Yeah, I had a, I think it was a raccoon, got in there, and as you can see, that's all of my bird feathers. It got one of my chickens. The slats right here, we put more up. I did not have no idea I've had this chicken coop for a year. Have not had any kind of animal to get in there. And last week, a raccoon got in there and killed one of my chickens. And that's where he got in because that's where he pulled my chicken out. So now we've boarded it up. And as you can see, there's really not a place now that a raccoon can fit. Thank the Lord. And he's been out here on camera, but he can't get in. And we would have caught him last night, but we caught the possum instead. So guys, this is where I'm gonna end this video. I'm going to go back in and get a bottle of water and cool off a little bit. I try to take it easy, stay out a little while, and then go back in. It's so hot. It's just too hot to do anything for 
a long period of time. Alrighty. Thank y'all for watching the videos. And if you haven't subscribed, subscribe. Hit the notification bell if you want to be notified when I put out more videos. And also, give me a thumbs up because that helps me in the realm of videos, people watching videos, if I get thumbs up on my videos. Thank y'all so much. I love you guys. God bless. The bush hog in the pig pen. And the pigs are running from him. There he is. Did you video me when I said daggum murders? Yes. <laughs> It'll be good. up here where the pigs are and see what they're doing in the midst of all this. Happy birthday, Mama. What's going on, girls? What's the matter? What's the matter? Huh? I don't see anything. Uh oh, you're in, uh, shade cloth this fell. Is something in here? There's the eggs under there. The egg's gone. Hey, Granny. See? They're laying the eggs under there instead of in here. And I don't know what's going on with that. I really don't. I may have to put it back over there in that corner. I hope it's not a snake getting in here. But we got the trap, and they got a honey bun in there. But undoubtedly, it didn't come last night because it's still in there, and the trap still set. And that little coffee can has the wormies in it, and 
it's usually pulled out here in the opening in the mornings when I feed the chickens. Oh yeah, they got to have some water. Some water. I don't know what they were fussing about. Something was going on. I need to put them in with the other chickens as soon as I catch that raccoon. He was on the camera again last night. Took the honey bun from the back of the trap. Never went in. Just reached in there and ate it by by bye. bye. Crazy. All right, the girls just calm down. Got Greeny over here. I know they're not scared of him. He don't bother me. He's just trying to catch a big rat. Trying to stay cool, ain't you, Greeny, Greeny? All right, girls, I'm gonna get you some water.